Good morning plant lovers. Today I'm going to show you what's blooming in my lotus garden. As you can see, all my lotus are growing in uh, pots that has no draining holes. So let's go for a walk. This one with medium-sized flower, it's called Holy Fire. It has a very golden center and lots of petals. And this one is very popular. It's a pink single. Also have a very gold looking center. It produces viable seeds. So when the seeds are green, it's edible. Or you can just let it grow until it's brown and leave it to uh, sow next year. Oh, this is my water chestnut. As you can see, it's turning brown. Reason being, I forgot to water it one day when it was really sunny. So all these water plants, uh, if you don't have water, they will die. So make sure you keep eye on the water level. This little beauty is called Rosa Plena. So the word Plena, it means double, double petals, lots of petals. This one's not very big because it's restricted by the size of the pot. Okay, we have a very big blooming Elba planner meaning the white double lotus. This pot is very healthy. It has quite a few buds about to open. is I believe it's also Rosa Plena it looks a little bit different I'm not sure what's called so it's also pink double and this is my mini lotus you see the leaves it's only my hand size smaller than my hand it's also producing flowers just by the look Judging by the color of the bud, it should be deep pink once it's bloomed. Okay. Oh, look at this one. It's Hunter Blaze. Very deep color. This variety, the flowers last longer. So generally speaking, if it's all sunny and the weather is good, uh, most of lotus will, the flowers will last about four to five. These little pots with very green leaves is my new variety this year. It's called Pink Glow. And there's one bud uh, developing already. So it's supposed to be white lotus with very uh, pink edges. leaves are very green in comparison to other varieties okay this one is also very popular it's called apple blossom it's a medium-sized lotus I produce a lot of flowers so this is the most free flowering uh, variety I have For those you haven't seen the lotus pods before, this is one. So you can see these individual seeds are developing in the pod. I believe this one is called um, cherished lotus. It's got a very unique shape. So it's like you know, really plump. It's a double lotus, light pink in color. And flowers a lot as well.
another Rosa Plena. You can see the size of the flower in comparison to my hand. Another apple blossom. So the apple blossom also produces viable seeds.